Hey everyone and welcome to my channel. Make sure you go ahead and click that subscribe button and that notification bell so you never miss a new video or a live stream and give me a big thumbs up at the end of the video. Hey Planner fam, welcome to 2019. Uh, eh, eh, eh. Hey you guys, you guys, you guys. First I wanna say welcome, welcome, welcome to my channel. To all of my newbies, welcome. I hope you stay, watch the video, subscribe to my channel, and click the notification bell. And to all of my old heads that's been rocking with me since 2018, welcome back. And I love you, love you, love you. So, y'all see it. Most of y'all that are new, and maybe some of my old heads that started rocking me a little bit later in the year of 2018 didn't see too many plan with me's in my faith planners. Not unless you went back and looked at some old videos and charged that to my head and not my heart because I was still trying to find my way in the planner community, plan, find my way as a YouTuber and a content creator. So I did kind of neglect doing my plan with me's, but I always use my faith planner. So this year's faith planner, I did not get the faith warrior because I wasn't a fan of the actual soap um, weekly spread. I like my traditional horizontal for my faith planner, but I did like the soap method. So. Before I get into my first plan with me for 2019 in my brand new faith planner, um, just wanna kinda flip through a couple of things with you. So if you wanna see the next portion of this plan with me, then stick around. <coughs> okay, so. I'm just gonna do like a quick flip through because what I do wanna do with each one of my planners for 2019 before I set it up for my first plan with me, just to kind of show you what I have in there. So I did some customizations. Um, I made a laminate pocket that I glued on and I don't know if I'm gonna use this. I just stuck it in here just to show you that this pocket will fit um, classic size paper. And this folder was in my planner from last year. I really love the colors and it matches the colors of this um, planner. So I left it in there. Um, and this is, I did my inside out because I didn't, I like this scripture, but I didn't like it for my main cover. So post-it notes and just to keep this here, just to jot down things, um, you know, a scripture or whatever the case may be. We all like our sticky notes. And then I have my lovely name here, vinyl print made by the lovely Tarshell B. And um, I really didn't do much to this planner in regards to adding extra um, things to it, just some dividers. So as I stated in my 2019 planner lineup video in a lot of my lives, I am using the soap inserts and I'm using this because every month I plan on having one main scripture that I focus on. Um, and then for the, you know, and as God reveals things and give me revelation, I'll add notes to it. So I'm going to always keep that in the front of my planner. And I will probably share this throughout the weeks. Um, each week I do a plan with me just to kind of let you see any, because I will, I Really, this is not personal to me. I want to share this part with you all. So, I haven't set up my um, monthly yet. Um, so, I do want to go ahead and set that up with you guys before I get into my first week, which will be Monday, December 31st through January the 6th. So, let's go ahead and get started with the setup of the monthly spread.
Okay, you guys, so I am finished my spread and my faith planner. And before I get into the details of this, just to kind of show you, this is how I set up the monthly view. And I normally use this just kind of randomly. Um, if I want to put down a specific scripture that stood out to me, stood out to me on a specific day, I might write that scripture there. Or say it as a scripture that a scripture <laughs> that I find and I want to read it, I might jot it down on here. I typically use this part to do my prayer list as God tells me a name to pray for or if someone reaches out to me for prayer I write it here so I can continue to pray for them for that month and that's about it so let's go to the weekly spread in the spread um, as always well y'all yeah, probably don't know always because I haven't done it in a while but if you check out some of my previous plan with me, you can kind of see that my planning style probably won't change much in my faith planner just because I believe in keeping as much white space as possible, but I still want some decoration to make it look pretty. That's just what I like. <laughs> so anyway, I use these gorgeous gold foil um, banners that came out of the new sticker book. This was the journal and sticker book. And this is perfect for me to write down the scripture that I'm reading for the day. And as I fill out my days, typically if I don't use up all the white space, I'll try to find some other stickers that match the color scheme to just fill in the white space. So the reading plan that I will be using for this week will be coming out of the Version Bible app. And it is, it all starts with a budget. I figured this is the perfect reading plan to start off for the year simply because most of us are probably being more mindful um, and intentional about how we spend and what we're budgeting on and why not start your budgeting plan based on what the word of God says about your finances so if you want to join me in on that reading plan I will leave the link in the description box as well if you go to my website I will also have this video up on my website along with the reading plan and I do plan on trying to um, incorporate any type of chats or questions or topics that come up during the week about the reading plan on the website so if y'all want to chat about the reading plan during the week please feel free to send me an email message or drop a comment in the comments box so with all that being said this is my weekly spread and my faith planner I'm excited to get back in it um, I will also reveal what my scripture of the month would be for my soap which is scripture observation application and prayer and that will be revealed on my website at hertestimony.com so if you like this video you know what to do give me a thumbs up and as always I welcome all comments in the comments box and make sure you go ahead and subscribe to the channel if you haven't already done so. And click the notification bell so you never miss a live stream or a new video. And as well, if this has inspired you, please, please, please make sure you share this with your planner friends so they can be inspired to create their own lovely plan. So until next time, planner fam, peace. Thank you again for watching Her Lovely Plan and I hope that you click that subscribe button and that notification bell.